ever seen in my life, bro. Look at that. I'm trying to figure out what it is. Holy, we're gonna get trapped in that. We gotta go. Oh my god. Finally sounds like it's back there instead of right in front of me. But I'm starting to get really scared. Like, Hi, this is James LaFur and you're watching the Impossible Channel. Welcome aboard. Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the channel with notifications on for more videos like this. Today we're going to be taking a look at insanely strange videos that were caught outdoors. Sometimes strange things happen when we decide to go out for a walk. Well, are you guys ready? Let's go. If you're an animal lover, you're probably aware that dogs and cats can sense, hear, and see things that humans can't. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Don't see! No! Now this is mostly because dogs and cats can hear and see through a spectrum of frequency that humans can't. This means that sometimes your dog or cat may start acting strange out of nowhere for no reason. And if you're out in the woods or in a very distant place, you should pay attention to it and maybe get the heck out of there as fast as possible. This is sort of what happened with Alice, a TikTok account who usually posts videos in the UK walking her dog, Miko, in the woods. One certain day, she was in the same trail that she usually takes when this happened. Scared. It's gonna get dark. It's like literally twilight right now. So, okay, I don't know whether it's because I'm filming a TikTok, but I'm starting to get really scared. Like, regardless, I have to go over there. I thought it must be an animal. Oh my god. Finally, sounds like it's back there instead of right in front of me. So, I think I'm in the clear. Someone please tell me what that noise is. Whatever it is that's making these noises, Alice's instinct is telling her to get the heck out of there. But she goes back thinking that it might be some sort of injured animal. Now I'm just thinking like, what if it's a dog that's like caught in like some thing? I don't know whether to go find it. I've come back. I've come back. It's moving around, so like it's now moving around. So like I've walked back because I thought it might be injured, but it's moving around. So it's not in one spot. It, it's moving and it's. I think it stopped. Curious and scared, Alice goes back home thinking that this might be some sort of unknown creature being that she's always taking this same trail and never heard anything like this. The next day she takes the trail once again with Miko but this time things go a bit different. This is what happens next. Okay so I'm at the start of the trail which goes up to the woods, however my dog's refusing to come with me. So. We'll see if I get there before the sun sets, which is in 30 minutes. I'm trying to get there, but the dog's acting really weird. Like, his tail's down. You okay, Miki? You're right, Annie. Good boy. And um, it's just, it's getting dark quicker than I thought it would. I walked past these yesterday and I didn't think they were creepy back then. Now they are. Everything is now. Miko, come. Come on. That day, Miko, her dog, sensed something strange in that woods, and Alice should have gotten back to her car and gone home that exact moment, but she didn't. She actually started a live video in her Instagram while she continued on investigating the trail. According to her, nothing much happened. This is until she went back to her car. Her viewers were sending her messages saying that they saw someone behind her. And this is what happens next. Okay, gang. Okay. 
I'm back at my car now. I just saw a bat as well, so this is like the prime time to leave. Um, I'm leaving now. Alice spots what appears to be some sort of footprint just next to her car. Her viewers also say that they saw something or someone behind her. Whatever it is that was following Alice that day, her dog sensed it, and she should have paid attention to it. However, my dog's refusing to come with me, so we'll see if I get there. Now keep in mind that this is the only strange video that Alice has ever uploaded into her account. She's not doing this for views, so whatever this thing is, it got her and her dog pretty spooked. And I guess that if it wasn't for her viewers telling her to get inside her car and leave, something else might have happened that day. In your opinion, what do you think was making those sounds and chasing her around in the woods that day? And has anything like this ever happened to you? Traveling with friends or family can be loads of fun and I guess most of the times we expect things to go just about right. But sometimes things turn out to be different. And this is sort of what happened with Corian and his friends who traveled to Switzerland to a small city by the name of Kanderstag. Now according to Corian who I spoke to, him and his friends were taking photos of the town and it was around 9pm that evening when a friend of his noticed something odd. They got their cameras and immediately started recording it. And this is what they caught on camera. Yeah, yeah. Holy <laughs> Look, Wait, look what? at that. How are you trying to figure out what it is? Yeah, I have no clue. What appears to be a humanoid shaped figure can be seen flying in the sky. And Corian and his friends were completely baffled. It couldn't be. They tried taking pictures and zooming in with the binoculars so they could see it better. However, it didn't seem to work out very much. Okay, Th there is a floating... There's nothing under it! No! There's nothing what? under it! What? At the time, they shrugged it off and went back to their normal lives. This is when, the next day, they seem to spot what appears to be the same thing, but this time in another part of the mountains. This is what they caught on camera. Oh, oh, that's beautiful quality. Hello. Oh, I see that. It looks like it looks like a paragliding. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Uh, that is definitely a paragliding. Oh, it's there. Yeah. It's definitely a paragliding. What the hell? No, I see that now. It's a paragliding. Oh, I see that. That's a paragliding. That's blue, white. No it's blue and white. It's a paragliding. It's a paragliding. No, it's been there for 14 hours. It's not a paraglider. Corian was randomly filming the mountains when all of a sudden they seemed to spot what appears to be the same thing. But this time video quality is much better and we can see that it's white and blue and this time it's floating sideways, a bit different. What is this thing? Corian and his friends immediately focus on the object and we can see it a bit better but still it's very difficult to make out what it is. Corian posted the video to Reddit and it amassed millions of views and thousands of comments. People were talking about it all over social media. One internet user suggests that it could be a balloon. But Corian stayed there for more than an hour taking videos and pictures and it stayed there floating in the same place. So it couldn't be. One person suggests that it could be power lines but to be very honest, I don't see any power lines in his photos and the second video, which has better quality, so I'm not too sure about power lines. It seems the more questions were made, the more mysterious it became. ¿Qué diablos es eso de allá? Esto ya no llega a ser normal, eh, gente. Demonios, demonios, escapa. Oh. 
Joder, joder. Demonio, ya no se ve. Now this isn't the first time something like this happens. Other flying humanoid videos have been captured on camera. Una persona, ¿no? Para. Una persona, huevón. And I guess the most compelling video was captured by Nadine Lorenzi, who saw what appears to be a humanoid figure flying just next to his airplane. In some of these videos we could even speculate it's a balloon or maybe a jetpack, however in some of them it's as baffling as it can get. And I guess it's the case with Corian's video. In your opinion, what do you think Corian captured on camera? What's your take? When I usually go fishing on a sunny day with my friends and family, I don't expect anything but fun moments. But sometimes, strange things happen. Holy, we're gonna get trapped in that. We gotta go. We gotta go. I got it, go. And on July 5th, 2022, something even stranger happened to Jimmy. Now, Jimmy and his family were out fishing in the Florida coast, to be more precise, 72 miles off of Sarasota. They were having a good time when all of a sudden they spot something falling from the sky. They try to get closer to it, when all of a sudden they see this green ooze coming from within the ocean. Ah! When they got even closer, they saw some sort of smoke coming from where this object fell. Now what's even stranger about this is that Jimmy and his brother at the time tried to contact the coast guard about it and for some mysterious reason communication systems were down. After posting this video to TikTok it amassed millions of views and thousands of comments. Some people suggested that this could be some sort of paint marking from rocket boosters but there were no other ships around which makes this a bit strange. In your opinion, what do you think this is and should have Jimmy gotten closer to it in the first place? A couple of weeks ago, Taylor Braid, one of our subscribers, emailed me a chilling video that I ended up featuring on the channel. In this video, Taylor and her friend are kayaking on a lake in Ontario, Canada, when all of a sudden they spot what appears to be a massive creature swimming just next to them. Now if you haven't seen this video fully, please do check it out. The thing is, at a certain moment, Taylor becomes dizzy because of the waves this creature is leaving behind. Oh, sorry. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but she goes back to recording and captures the creature making a U-turn. Whatever this thing is, it was massive and she caught it all on camera. But the question is, what is this? A couple of days after publishing this video to my YouTube channel, dozens of subscribers came in with videos of what's supposed to be the same thing, and it was captured all over the world. In this next video, for instance, we can see a family having a good time on a lake in Argentina when all of a sudden, this happens. Check this out. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. Kiss. Whatever this monster-like creature is, it was captured by this family in Colico Lake in Argentina, 
and now scared by what they're seeing, they try to warn the other group of people just next to them. Cuidado! Whatever it is that this family caught on camera, they saw it clearly and it scared them. The thing is, internet users were divided. Some think that this is a phenomenon that occurs in certain lakes or waves caused by the tides. While others believe that this might actually be some sort of ancient monster-like creature that inhabits lakes all over the world. But I guess that when it comes to creepy sightings like this one, the most chilling one was recorded by Aki Ribar YouTube channel on April 2021. He writes, Something unusual was recorded in an old mine in Golubara, Serbia. Whether this is a huge catfish or a mysterious animal, no one knows yet. But the video shows that this is something huge. In the video, we can see what appears to be a crane operator recording a lake just next to a mine in Kolubara, Serbia. To the top right, you can see a highway with cars. When all of a sudden, this is captured on camera. At first, what appears to be a giant eel or maybe a whale-like creature can be seen swimming in the lake. But the crane operator continues recording this baffling video. And this is what happens next. A massive creature is captured on camera in Kolubara, Serbia. Whatever this thing is, in my opinion, it's too big to be any known animal. And I guess this is exactly what the person who was recording was thinking. To the top right, you can see the highway and cars just as a reference for size. So again, whatever this thing is, it's huge. The more we find evidence of such creatures, the more questions we have. Questions like, why have these creatures been spotted all over the world throughout time? Where they hide? Where they come from? Is it maybe from some sort of underwater cave system that we're not aware of? In your opinion, what do you think is going on here? Is this really some sort of monster-like mystery creature? Or is it something else? What's your take? Now just imagine the following situation, you're cooking dinner at your house when all of a sudden you hear this loud boom and when you go outside, things look different. Well, this is sort of what happened in San Antonio Chalco in Mexico a couple of weeks ago when a family noticed a rift opening just next to their house. It started very small and it began to grow until it became really big. I mean, 25 meters deep and a couple of meters wide. Esta grieta se sigue, es subterránea, pero ya nos partió las casas, entre ellas la mía. Se están extendiendo, o sea, a, a lo ancho. No sé. Now experts believe this has something to do with strong rain, but other than that, there is absolutely no explanation for this phenomena. But it seems that it's not just in Chalco, Mexico. Rifts like this one and sinkholes have been opening all over the world 
for the last couple of years and no one knows exactly why. In Africa, for example, a huge rift opened up and at first people thought it had to do with the fact that Africa is separating into two continents, or maybe that it was an earthquake. But then experts came in and actually said it had to do with none of them. It was a mystery. Something very similar occurred with a sinkhole that opened up in Chile recently, just next to a copper mine. At first, experts thought that this huge sinkhole that opened up was linked with the mining just next to it. But after taking a detailed look into this massive sinkhole, experts are now unsure of what really caused it and why it keeps growing in size. What's most intriguing is that sinkholes and rifts like these ones keep showing up and some of them actually remain a complete mystery. But just like you and me, there are some people out there who are curious to find out what hides beneath these sinkholes. A YouTuber by the name of Tacrax actually did a curious experiment where he throws an iPhone into a sinkhole and this is what he captured on camera. Pretty crazy guys, you can see there's steam coming straight out of this water, um, grass growing on the edges here. It's supposed to be about 140 to 180 degrees Fahrenheit, but it's super sick, literally in the middle of nowhere. Tacrax and his team carefully fly the phone into the sinkhole water, and this is what happens. For some mysterious reason, Tacrax actually records what sounds like a demonic voice coming from within the sinkhole. Whatever this is, to this day it's a mystery, just like most of the rifts and sinkholes showing up all over the world. But this isn't the only video portraying strange things that happen below the surface. In 2018, engineers were repairing a tunnel in Medellin, Colombia when they noticed this mysterious phenomenon and started recording it. While some believe that this is some sort of interdimensional portal that was caught on camera, Experts think that this is due to the water pressure building and pressing against the floor of the tunnel. However, it only occurred once or twice, what makes it really strange. And to this day, the reason remains a complete mystery. Now taking into consideration that humans have only been able to dig 12 kilometers deep into Earth's crust, the reasons for these mysterious rifts and sinkholes could be many. In your opinion, what do you think is going on here? Why is this strange phenomenon occurring? I remember when I was much younger, I used to watch superhero movies and ask myself if one day I would also have superpowers. As I grew up, I found out it wasn't exactly like that, but that's okay because it basically happens with everyone, or almost everyone. In this video, for instance, Jeff Janish was walking his dog in Russia in the woods when all of a sudden something catches his dog's attention. Tarzan. Tarzan come near. He followed his dog and what happened next left him speechless. He comes upon what appears to be a mother and a daughter supposedly levitating, hidden in the middle of the woods. 
Throughout time, there have been many people who have shown to have some sort of superpower. From Buddhist monks levitating and changing their body temperatures, to Wim Hof withstanding extreme cold temperatures, there are a few people out there who have superhuman powers that to this day, experts can't explain. Now what I find interesting is that most of these superhumans claim to use some sort of altered state of mind to achieve most of these abilities. It's as if they have unlocked the human brain somehow. That ball of light, that awareness, and consciously move it to any area of the mind that you want to go to. And if somebody or something is pulling that awareness to an area of the mind that you don't want to go to, you use your willpower and your powers of concentration. Now if this is the case, then maybe it would help explain some really strange videos out there. A couple of weeks ago, a man by the name of Isaac Luna started posting strange and odd videos to social media. Isaac usually posts videos of him doing his daily chores. Try out the Robin Grant special. Establish my territory. He knows this area is mine. Or exercising his body and mind. This is until last week, when his subscribers noticed something odd. This, for instance, is the first video where things start to get strange with Isaac's account. Envision the shoulder press. 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 That's the movement. Looks so something like that. If you have any questions, let me know, but um, everyone should be able to do this movement. When I first watched this video, I was pretty sure that this man was somehow levitating using some sort of camera trick or maybe a rope. And I guess most people thought that too. His Instagram and TikTok followers were completely divided between is this a camera trick, a green screen, or is it maybe real? This is when Isaac posted his second video in a different setting in his backyard. Check this out. However it is that Isaac is doing this, he left most of his viewers baffled. But still, there were people who thought he was using some sort of green screen or a special effect. Isaac then posted a third video in the grass, in the middle of his backyard, not touching any wall. Check this out. Focus. As Isaac posted more of these videos, it became stranger by the day. If it's a trick or not, no one knows how he's doing it. People all over the world were trying to do the same thing on TikTok and Instagram without any success. And to prove that he wasn't using any green screen, Isaac posted a fourth video showing his backyard. He also posted a couple of the methods that he's using to achieve this ability. The books that he's reading, the Tesla coil that he bought, 
and what he calls exercising the core energy every day. Whatever it is that's going on here, I'm pretty sure that it should be a trick, but no one has figured out how it is that he's pulling it. In his last video, we can see clearly he's not using any rope of any sort or green screen special effect. Check this out. Levitation. How is it that Isaac is doing this? If it was supposed to be some sort of elaborate trick, there would be hundreds, thousands of people maybe doing the same thing on TikTok and Instagram, and this isn't the case. So what's going on here? Is this maybe the real deal? Is it some sort of glitch in the simulation or is it some sort of superpower? What's your take? Well, this is it for now, but we do have more videos. Don't forget to check them out. And don't forget to leave a like if you enjoyed this one and subscribe to the channel with notifications on for more videos like this. If you'd like to contact me with strange videos, please do at thatimpossiblechannel at gmail.com. I also left some other important links under the description. See you guys again.